Hello. <laughs> welcome back. Welcome in. Welcome all. I'm the convalescing soul. I um, am traveling and so I don't have my all my little accoutrements set up. Um, so I have my little <laughs> mic from headphones that I'm having to hold like this. So hopefully um, this works um, until I'm back home. Let me apologize. I'm, I'm still kind of recovering from jet lag and an eight hour time difference. Oh my gosh, look at my finger. I also banged my finger. Like it looks way better than it did. I banged my finger. It looked so gross. But it's healing. I'm actually amazed how quickly it's healing. Um, our bodies really are amazing. We just, we heal. We heal so quickly, right? Whether it be physical or mental or emotional, <laughs> it's like we're born to heal, you know? It can be a message for someone. Okay. I'm just going to preface this right now by saying expect lots of yawns because I can feel it. Bear with me, uh, my body, I, I'm not tired, but I think my body's tired, <laughs> as weird as that sounds. Uh, I just noticed I've been yawning a lot lately. I think, you know, it usually takes a couple days, right, for your body to adjust back, so. Anyways, this one might be a little bit of a rough reading, so I appreciate your, your patience. We are on number 21, the Orchid Priestess of Destiny. 21 reduces to a 3. As you can see, we have this lovely lady playing a flute. I used to play the flute when I was in 7th, 8th, and ninth grade. When I was first learning, I would get lightheaded because you're just you're blowing out so much air, and if you're not used to it, you get kind of dizzy. Here we go. Let's let's start this. <laughs> let's get this uh, show on the road <laughs> before another yawn comes. Okay. The Orchid Priestess of your highest spiritual destiny calls you now, beloved. She calls you to your purpose, path, and soul passion. You are called to rise again and again to live up into your potential with all its uniqueness and beauty. She will call you always with her sweet flute playing deep in your heart. Blossoms of Blossoms of orchid and chrysanthemum falling from her feet, stirring your heart to quest for your truest soul passion. You may have felt different to those around you at different times in your life. I know I did. Sometimes I still do. <laughs> I think that's normal. This is meant to be, beloved one. You cannot be a pioneer of different consciousness on this planet if you feel completely comfortable in the consciousness that already exists around you. Do you know that this, do you know that this was chosen on purpose so you could be on purpose? Your soul chose to be of service by not fitting in so that it would remember through things not feeling right that it was meant to help correct and heal the consciousness on our planet starting with the self. Once the self was able to connect and align the consciousness within so that it matched the love and peace that existed deep in the heart, it would be easier to help others do the same even if just by inspiration. 
you may have felt, nope, that's not where we are. This is where the Orchid Priestess of Destiny, beloved Quan Yin, in her devotion to your highest spiritual attainment, calls you forward now. Yes, beloved, your divine destiny is calling you. That means it is time to unplug from mass consciousness at a deeper level than ever before, to really let go of the beliefs and thought forms that do not serve your highest destiny, no matter how unchallengeable they may seem to be. At first, <laughs> it is time to revise anything of si inside of you that would hold you back from owning your spiritual power and moving ahead in your divine destiny. It is your own destiny that calls you forward to do this, beloved. Do not fear. It is just you waiting to meet you in all your spiritual beauty and strength. Embrace the changes and soon you will enjoy this spiritual reunion at a higher turn of the spiral of your own passionate life of spiritual purpose. The flute and blossoms of the Orchid Priestess help, help you in this process now. This is how we heal with the Orchid Priestess of Divine Destiny. Imagine that you are standing in the center of a spiral that extends above and below you with a softly lit glow. Sorry, the window is very thin here. <laughs> with a softly lit glowing goddess Kuan Yin beside you, blossoms of flowers fall around her. Orchid motifs are embroidered on her clothing as she plays a melody on a soft flute straight into your heart. As you look down, you can observe where you have been vibrationally and how much you've grown spiritually over the months and years. Well done. You look above and not only sense where you are going, but also feel the pull in your heart to help you get there. As you listen to Kuan Yin playing her flute into your heart chakra, you find that you are able to rise easily, your heart expanding as you ascend to the next rung of the spiral. Say, thank you Kuan Yin. Orchid Priestess of Divine Destiny for your unconditionally loving assistance to help me step up into the next phase of my divine destiny now. I remember... Wait a second... Nope, I don't remember. I embrace it <laughs> with all my heart. Sometimes I don't know what my eye thinks, my eyes think that they see, but there's... Nowhere on here does it say remember. <laughs> I embrace it with all my heart, so be it. All many pod may hum. Feel yourself on the new level of the spiral and take a few breaths here. There. Excuse me. Or yawn. <laughs> Hear the flute of the Orchid Priestess like it were playing now within your own heart center and becoming more comfortable in this new turn of your spiral, spiritual spiral. Be aware of that feeling in your heart flowing down both sides of your body into your hips, legs and feet and then up from the heart to your chest shoulders and arms, neck and head. Bring your awareness back to your heart and when you are ready, just open your eyes. This is your prayer to the Orchid Priestess of Destiny. 
Where did I put her card out? You can see it one more time. I'll try and hold the mic and the book and the card all at the same time. Let's see if I can do it. <laughs> my destiny is in my own heart and you guide me deeper within myself beloved orchid priestess so I cannot miss out on anything that is divinely ordained for me it will always find me at peace in my heart I now receive that which is guiding me in unconditional love into the fullness and expression of my own divine being. Om Mani Padme Hum. Thank you for enduring and being patient <laughs> and still hanging in there with me. Um, I wish you all a beautiful day and much love and blessings to you always. Bye.